Okay, I know that you have seen tons of photoresistor um, videos, but this one's a little bit different in the fact that uh, we're constraining the values. Because one of the things I want to use the Arduino for is to control lights in my home. So there has to be kind of a uh, trigger um, light value. So just through experimentation, I found out that in this room, my trigger value was 970. Uh, so the analog readings go from 0 to 1,023. And 970 seemed to be uh, any darker than that, and I would like it to come on. However, I like the light level to kind of remain the same um, in the room. So, what I've done is, um, basically what the program does is it, it reads the value from the uh, photoresistor. It's going through a, a 1K uh, resistor. feeds into analog input pin number 5. And we just have an LED over here. And so we read the photoresistor value and we constrain it. There, that's a function uh, within the Arduino uh, language. And so I'm constraining the value from 970 to 1023. So only those values go through. Otherwise, I guess it uh, returns zero. I don't know. I don't have the... The, the syntax in front of me. So, if the light value is darker, so if the value goes past 970, then we trigger the uh, light to go on. Okay, so you can see it, 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 it fades in and it'll fade out. She might work better if I turn this light on. So that will be a useful uh, lighting application for your home. Uh, you decide, yeah, I like it, this, anything darker than this, and I would like it to start turning on. And uh, using the constrain function, it works perfectly. So uh, one thing... I do worry about is it, if the light turns on it might uh, turn off because the light in the room will go up so we'll have to set up something for that but this is just kind of a proof of concept for myself that you can make a lighting system um, with a trigger uh, trigger light intensity so I might also use this for my aquarium as well so, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, it's just, I know that there's been lots of photoresistor ones, but this kind of adds a twist, and I hope you enjoy it.